Today I'm using the model 2125 HDP clear hand wrench from Golden Snipper Products. It's a two inch hand wrench and I'm also using the experimental gravity trap concentrator. Now I've been working on this section right here. This is all bedrock right here. There's a big rock down in there and I've been trying to get as deep, go as deep as I can with the hand wrench. Right now, I'm pretty far down in there. I'm hoping when I clean out, I have some gold. But for right now, I'm going to keep on working. The full area in here, where the bedrock is, and then there's this big rock down here, I'm going in between those. It started out right about here, and I've worked my way all the way down in this deep with the hand wrench. Since it's two inch hand wrench, it pulls a lot of the material out. It leaves very little to be pulled out by hand. I'm getting down in here pretty good. some gold down in here. Okay, I'm all done hand dredging with the model 2125 HDP clear hand dredge from Golden Stipper Products. The two inch hand dredge made from clear plastic. And I'm also using the experimental gravity trap concentrator. It's about time for the clean out. I've made this hole right here deeper. You can see this rock right there. And you can see the bedrock right there. The reason I'm working it is because I'm anticipating that this is a rock zone for gold right in there. Okay. I've added to the pile of tailings that I built up a couple weeks ago. You can see the sides of the rocks that were pumped through the hand dredge, all easily two inch flat. The model 2125 really moves material fast. The experimental gravity trap concentrator is made out of polypropylene. It's real thin and flexible. So, when it starts getting abrasions on it, the chances of it breaking through are real good. So the easiest way to patch it up is to use hot glue. Right here, it had a nice hole starting, so I put hot glue on it. 
Over here, some more of the abrasions were starting to break through, so I put hot glue on it. Hot glue holds real good, prolongs the life of the experimental gravity trap concentrator. Okay, I'm ready for the clean out. 